Welcome back to another Madden NFL 25 video in which today we have a NFC and AFC conference matchup between the Jacksonville Jaguars and the Philadelphia Eagles. Let me know in the comments below who do you guys think will win this game in real life and what do you guys think the score will be. If you like this type of content, like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out and I appreciate all the support as we are trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. So without further ado, Let's get straight into this one and see which team will come out on top. Let's get it. Jalen Hurts and the Eagles offense will get the ball first to start off the game. So let's go take a look at his stats from last year as he went 352 out of 538 attempts, 38, 58 yards, 23 touchdowns to 15 interceptions. Here on second and three, Jalen Hurts has time in the pocket as he steps back and scrambles. He will rush and get the first down with a gain of seven yards, taking it up to the 40-yard line. Here on second and two, Jalen Hurts hands the ball off to Saquon Barkley, who bounces it out to the outside and finds space on the right side, taking it up to the Jacksonville 40-yard line. Here on 2nd and 2, Jalen Hurts steps back in the pocket and fires it over the middle as the pass is caught and completed to number 88 on the play, Dallas Goddard, who takes it into the red zone down to the Jacksonville 15-yard line. And let's take a look at the replay right there as that was a perfect pass from Hurts and a great job by Goddard to reel in that pass as he muscles through one defender and gets huge yardage on the play. Here on 3rd and 5, Jalen Hurts has time in the pocket as he rolls to his left. He is going to complete the pass to his tight end, Dallas Goddard, who takes it inside the 5, down to the 4-yard line for an Eagles first and goal. Here on 3rd and goal, Jalen Hurts rolls out to his right and completes the pass to Saquon Barkley for the touchdown as the Eagles will put up the first points of the game, taking a 7-0 lead over the Jaguars. And let's go take a look at the replay right there as the pressure looked to be coming from the middle and left-hand side, leaving the right side of the field wide open for Hurts to complete the pass to Saquon. It is now time for Trevor Lawrence to take to the field for the first time today. So let's go take a look at his stats from last year as he went 370 for 564 attempts, 40 16 yards, 21 touchdowns to 14 interceptions. Here on first and 10, Trevor Lawrence has a read option, keeps it himself, and is sacked in the backfield by Williams on the play. As the first quarter comes to a close, the Eagles have a 7 0 lead over the Jaguars. Here on 3rd and 13, Trevor Lawrence is in the pocket and escapes towards the right side, but is met in the backfield for a sack by number 93 on the play. This will make it a 4th and 20, a 3 and out for the Jaguars as they are pushed back to their 17. Here on 3rd and 8, Jalen Hurts has time in the pocket as he is going to scramble towards the right hand side and keep it himself as he is able to get the first down taking it into Jaguars territory at the 48 yard line. Here on third and eight Jalen Hurts has time in the pocket as he scrambles out of it towards the right hand side he is going to keep the ball himself and get the first down as he takes it inside the 30 down to the 28 yard line. And let's go take a look at the replay right here to see how the play unfolded. And Jalen Hurts had great protection in the pocket, but found space wide open on the right-hand side and took it himself. Here on 1st and 10 on the play right after, Jalen Hurts fires it over the middle as the pass is caught and completed to his receiver number 11 on the play. That is A.J. Brown with the reception as the Eagles now double their lead and take a 14 to nothing lead over the Jaguars here in the second quarter. And Brown does a great job to get behind the entire Jacksonville defense and take it to the house. Here on first and 10, Trevor Lawrence has lots of time in the pocket as he scans the field and works the right side of the field as the pass is caught and completed to rookie Brian Thomas Jr. for the first down at the 43 yard line. It is now 3rd and 10 for the Jaguars, and Trevor Lawrence feels the pressure and just has to get rid of it. And this is where the Jacksonville drive will stall as the Eagles will get the ball with 105 remaining here in the first half. Here on 1st and 10, Jalen Hurts 
has time in the pocket as he airs it out towards the left sideline. Pass is caught and completed to Dallas Goddard, who gets the first down and takes it up to the 39-yard line. And let's go take a look at the replay right here, as Hertz had all the time in the world in the pocket and fired it to his wide open tight end who does a great job to get both feet in bounds here on first and 10 on the play right after the eagles are looking to score before the end of the first half as he works the left sideline again and completes it to aj brown who takes it up to the jaguars 41 yard line here on second and eight jalen hurts is in the pocket and is met in the backfield as he is sacked making it a third and 16 at the 47 yard line and let's go take a look at the replay right here to see how the play unfolded. And that is Heinz Allen that comes up with the sack on Hertz. As he does a great job to break through the left tackle and get straight after the quarterback. The Jaguars get the ball to, to start off the second half. And here on the first play they hand it off to Travis Etienne who gets the first down and takes it into Eagles territory at the 48 yard line. Here on third and seven, Trevor Lawrence has a nice clean pocket. As he rolls out to his left, he works it towards the left sideline as the pass is caught and completed to Brian Thomas Jr., who takes it up to the Eagles' 26-yard line. And let's take a look at the replay right here to see how the play unfolded. And Trevor Lawrence had a nice clean pocket and identified the open receiver for the nice first down. Here on second and one, Trevor Lawrence completes under center as the pass is caught and completed to Evan Ingram as the Jaguars will score their first points of the game. And let's go take a look at the replay right here to see how the play unfolded. And Ingram had great block up front and found the open spot in the end zone. Great drive by the Jaguars to get on the board. Here on 2nd and 10, Jalen Hurts has time in the pocket as he surveys the field and works the right sideline as the pass is caught and completed to Saquon Barkley who takes it up to the Jaguars 44 yard line. Here on 2nd and 2, Jalen Hurts fires it out quickly towards the left side of the field as the pass is caught and completed for a first down inside the red zone at the 18 yard line. That is number 83 with the reception. Here on second and goal, Jalen Hurts quickly fires it towards the right side of the field as the pass is caught and completed to Dallas Goddard as the score is now 21-7 starting off the fourth quarter. Here on second and three, Trevor Lawrence has time in the pocket as he surveys the field and completes the pass towards the left side of the field as the pass is caught and completed to number 13, Christian Kirk, who takes it up to the Eagles 44-yard line. It is now fourth and inches and the Jaguars are going to go for it as they hand it off to Etienne who takes it up the middle and gets to the red zone at the 20 yard line as we hit the two minute warning. Here on first and 10 Trevor Lawrence has lots of time surveys the field and completes the pass over the middle for the first down at the seven yard line. It will set up the Jaguars with a first and goal. It is now fourth and goal for the Jaguars at the one yard line and they are going to take it to the house as the score is now 14 to 20 with a couple minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter. The Jaguars set up for an onside kick as it is made it is recovered by Eagles player as they will get a first down and just need one first down to ice the game right here. Here on 2nd and 2, Hertz is going to hand it off to Saquon Barkley who takes it up the middle and easily gets the first down as he takes it up to the 21 yard line and the Jaguars use their final time out. Jalen Hurts now leads his team into victory formation as they will let the clock run down to triple zeros and the Philadelphia Eagles will defeat the Jacksonville Jaguars 20-15. to Let me know in the comments below who do you guys think will win this game in real life and what do you guys think the score will be. If you like this type of content, like and subscribe. It really helps the channel out and I appreciate all the support as we are trying to get to 1,000 subscribers. If you're a fan of the NFL and college football, stay tuned as we'll be covering both all season long. Appreciate all the support and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.